harmonica lesson number five. Today we're learning to feel the beat, but let's start with our warm up, and you don't even need the harmonica. Just make some funny faces. Uh, and some funny noises. Uh, I like this one. Round and round. Like a washing machine. Uh, to warm up the muscles in our face, and now we're ready to play. So that is Star Number One Island for today's lesson. So what's the beat? Well, you've actually already heard the beat when we've used my metronome. You've seen this. Oh, it's already started. You've seen this in previous lessons, and this is keeping the beat for us. And the beat helps us to feel the music, to get inside the music and really be a proper musician. So I want you to feel the music from your head to your toes. Ooh, smelly. But the beat is the heart of the music. It's pumping all the time. So see if you can gently tap a beat along with me. Let's just try that for a minute. Good. Keep it nice and steady. And can you count to four? I reckon you probably can. Of course you can. I'm sorry I even doubted that you could count to four. So let's try counting to four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now we're counting to four because, well, that's what musicians do. Most music is counted in fours, which makes it really easy. You know, most musicians can't even count past four, so it makes it a lot easier for us. And that's something that we really want to get into doing when playing music. So, if you've given that a go, that's our second star earned for today's lesson. Oh, what's that clicking sound? That's my metronome going again. So, for our third star in today's lesson, we're gonna try our C major scale with the metronome, but we're also gonna be tapping the beat. Now, you don't have to hit yourself on the heart as I'm doing, you could click, or you could tap your feet on the floor. Don't know if you'll hear this. But you could do that. I would say you could clap your hands, but it's very difficult to play the harmonica if you're not using your hands. So I'm gonna tap like this, but it might be easiest to tap your foot. Just try and count along or tap along with the beat. And then I'm gonna count us in, one, two, three, four, and then we're gonna play along with the beat. Remember the C major scale from last lesson? That's what we're gonna play. Okay, one, two, three, four. And then back down, one, two, three, four. Well done. Well, I can hear some very nice playing there, really good clean notes, but don't worry if you're not perfectly in time or if your notes aren't completely clean. It's just about giving this a go and you'd need to take your time and practice, practice, practice to get it perfect. We've all learnt our third star for today's lesson, which means that everything is done. Join me for harmonica lesson number six when we're going to have the shakes. <laughs> ah, that is a perfect cup of tea. Oh, hello. This bit's for the grown-ups. I hope your little ones enjoyed my lesson today. If you'd like to say thank you, then please consider giving something to one of the great charities listed beneath the video. Cheers.